Hi guys, and welcome back to Nostrand Farm. Where are we up to, episode 3? Birds are having a whale of a time in there. Yep, I've got auto combine running up and down the field, and the New Holland chasing them about. So, that's going smoothly. Well, as smooth as can be, anyway. No, wrong one. That was the one we wanted, and the bales are still here. Now we're going to use the excellent little JCB loader here. And we're just going to destroy all these bales. <laughs> you might be saying to yourselves, oh, the rear view on this is horrendous. Why go to the hassle of bailing them if you're just going to destroy them? Because I just like bailing. Never actually tried lifting three with this telehandler. But it seems to cook. <laughs> it must have a huge trigger on here. It isn't going to take long to destroy these. <laughs> yep, it's got a huge trigger. <laughs> so I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to move this JCP. And we'll make sure we have it out of the way for the new Holland coming in. That should do for now. And we'll jump back to the other JCB. And as it has a huge trigger, we might as well push them in. This articulated um, JCB is actually starting to grow on it. When the DLC first came out, I must admit I wasn't overly impressed. Um, but it is starting to grow on it. I've used it on a few private games. And I can't really grumble. It's an awesome model. It does the job. I've never found a sticky point with it. So, yeah, it's coming on. I have actually just downloaded the uh, free DLCs. The latest one, which is the New Holland Shovel and Telehandler. But believe it or not, I haven't even looked at it yet. So that probably was a little bit of a waste of time. <laughs> but we have got a little bit more money in the bank. He's unloading again. Excellent. And cracking on well. And we're back at the zero. Might as well jump in the cab. And get this cultivated and probably bring down the. Oh, uh, you dipstick. Helps if you set GPS a bit. <laughs> Oh, 
we'll bring the cedar down and see about get, getting some um, getting some um, seeds back in the ground oh, I'm in the hedge, that's where the trouble is left that turn a little bit too late again but yeah I'm not sure about this is the first time I've used GPS and I'm not sure if there's any quick function buttons that's the first time I've seen the train go in that direction <laughs> as you can see I always end up having to just spin it around here and use the cursor to set GPS away again so if there is a quick function button for that and somebody knows what it is please let me know <laughs> Yeah, this is no match for the Xeron, no match whatsoever. As you can see, the cultivator is getting dirty already. The big lemkin. And only the tyres on the Xeron. completely overshot the mark there completely overshot it not to worry but yeah I'm hoping you're enjoying this map and it's interesting to know if anybody else is who's watching is playing on it How did you make your money? Where did you start? As I've said, I think we're going to go into the BGA and try and make our money that way. Or is the way forward selling the crops? which way will be the easiest train's going by again I suppose what I should be doing is selling now that wheat that we've made off this field and what we're making off the other field which I may have to do anyway, so I can buy a forage harvester. Might be the sensible option. And I haven't had any warnings from course play, so everything must be going right. New Holland obviously hasn't crashed, so it's all good. <coughs> the Xeron is just munching its way through this field. I've overshot them out again. But we have the power to pull it out. <laughs> it's 
stick a cultivator in the hedge. And off we go again. As you can see, I've now got the time mod, display time mod, and it's 10.43 at night. Just so I can keep an eye on the time a little bit easier. I've said it once before, but I need to keep the videos at the 20 minute mark. Yeah, there's got to be a hot key for GPS somewhere along the line. I right, can just hit the button and it's already set. I've been un unable to find it so far. Now, according to Glance, the Combine thinks he's finished. I just look looked up there. So, what we're going to do is we'll just shut everything down and we'll jump up there and see what's going on dipstick has reversed into the hedge I knew he couldn't be finished as Reefy likes to call him um, alcoholic Charlie no man he is a good worker, he just tends to be a little wild at times. So while he's working over here, I think we'll just jump out, because it'll get a bit loud in there. Peace and quiet. And we're just going to go through and see what we've got. Yeah, see the price of wheat down, which isn't much help to us. Seeing as though we have 133,000 litres in. Now, weather forecast good all the way through. Aha! Uh -huh. Um, I'm just going to get rid of that little map because I don't need it. On, off, thank you. Yeah, we could do with the prices going up a bit and sell all the wheat that we've gathered up I don't think I'll bail this I've just remembered that I have a little toy in the shop correct me if I'm wrong but that also picks up straw and turns it into chaff 5,000 I could be wrong but I think it has been tested do I have this little force grift force grit I could chaff the straw swath I'm sure this does let's buy it it's 5,000. We'll have it reset. No. We'll try the correct button. Um, 
we'll reset that back to the farm and of course the only tractor we've got available when I find it is the JCB which didn't start first time ah, I don't have a spare tip though that's a trouble some plunk about went out and bought all this random stuff to play on this map but he only bought himself one little tipper I do have the big man truck that I could be sorry, A-M-M-A-N truck let's just see is there anything in the F1? Pipe out. Let's just have a look here. Tidy this bit up there. Eh? Now to me that is chuffing. Excellent. That gives us an option anyway. I'll pick this up and run it down to the. Ah, oh, it's not good leaving that there. New Holland bound to go into there. I'm sure that's where his stop point is. We'll leave the JCB here. And that'll remind us. And we'll just nip down. Ah, that was good timing, wasn't it? Right, you're in the New Holland's trying to eat a hedge. And is that New Holland going to try and eat that hedge? <coughs> I would say he is, you know. Alcoholic Charlie up with his little tricks. Nope. Good stuff. Let's finish this off. Excuse me, guys. So we'll try and get this finished and then we'll cut the video and see what I can do with the uh, next one. Now that we've got ourselves a little chaffing device. Be able to get into the BGA slightly quicker. certainly go around cutting some grass in the next episode uh, I think we'll just knock GPS off 
and we'll start doing the headlands. If I can catch all of them. And so oh, that was the one. <laughs> Hopefully it'll only take two passes. There's a mighty cultivator of this one. Get rid of this chopped straw. It does take a bit of lag. Awesome. Just cut these untidy pieces down here. And that should just leave us with one more pass around the field. Missed a tiny bit there, but I'm not too worried. Combine's now blocked. Just as you say that, we have a crash on our hands. Oh, he's just trying to eat the hedge again. He's got a little course there. At least Auto Combine tries to find a way out now. See, he's searching for a way out. Looks like he's gonna make it. But I'm going to stop him there. Because he's making some lovely windrow art. And we're gonna fire him up there. get this cultivating finished twice in one episode I've seen that <laughs> I honestly thought the train only ran that one direction I've only ever seen it running the other way until recently. It's nice to know that it's both lines are used. Sure there's a lot of commuters on there so looking out over this beautiful farmland. Wondering why are they wasting their lives sitting in an office all day? I thought I was getting a bit close to that hedge. So ideally, we'd like a great demand to come in or the price to go up on wheat and make some money that way. Or otherwise, we're going to be cutting grass, chaffing it with our new little toy and getting into the BGA as quickly as possible because I'm sure once I start getting the sprayer on, on the job it's going to start costing an awful lot of money to keep this farm growing don't think I've got all that nope I'm not bothered about the slight bit in the corner, it was more the inside line that I wanted. Missed the hedge, good stuff. We 
we're going to finish in the wrong corner because we've already done this other side and that's the first field done Yep, this is all done. So we can lift it, fold it, oh, clip the edge. And I'm going to call it a video there, guys. As the train goes whistling by again. So I'll thank you again, for, once again, for watching. And if anybody has any hints or tips on GPS, Please be so kind to leave a comment below. I've been Shawnee B and this is Nuston Farm. Bye for now.